Okay, I'm so sorry, everyone. I hope uh, I forgot to ask our administrator to give me the premium account. So at the moment, I'm using my own. Press this too. Yeni is God speaking Indonesian. Ding, 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 ding. <laughs> okay. So I'm going to put you in the breakout room. Uh, if it's up to me, it will be only six minutes. Will you be okay with that? Fine. Okay, then Fine. six minutes in the breakout room. Let's try and complete. Practice two, okay? So I'm waiting for Miss Puput, oh, done. Miss Wati is still trying to connect, okay. There you go, everyone is back in this room. So everyone, you have six minutes in the breakup room to complete. If you have finished early, feel free to come to the main session immediately, okay? The companion complaint. There it is. <laughs> you may join the, the group is already how Miss... to join don't you have the notification to join the breakout room no i don't have the notification miss okay let me try mr bagus how about you you are with mr agung i'm going to try to how about now, Miss Lisa? Do you see the notification? Still, still don't get the notification, Miss. Uh -oh. Maybe because I join it from the browser. Oh, uh, it doesn't matter usually. It's done. Okay. Mm -hmm. I don't see any notification. Okay. So, well, you and Miss Yeni can stay here and solve the problem then. I will move Miss Noor to room two. <laughs> Miss Wati is also at join. Okay, you may start, Miss Yeni and Miss Lisa. Okay. I will go to another room then. See you later, okay? Okay, Miss. Hello, Mbak Yeni. Do you already read the practice too? Yes. Okay. Miss Puput, I'm so sorry. I don't know what happened to Miss Yeni, but she was supposed to be your partner. Okay. Uh, okay. <laughs> but means what? Apa nomor apa jawaban nomor satu? It's from the background. <laughs> okay, I'm putting Miss. Uh, I'm putting Mr. Priyok here. I hope he can join us. Ah, finally, there you go. Miss Puput, your partner is Mr. Priyok. Okay, Mr. Priyok? thank you. Can you hear Pre us? But you still have three more minutes. I hope that will be enough. Okay. Thank you. Um. Sorry. 
yang saya sorry mana saya sorry kan kita sorry yang sampai masih salah tu ini komplain ya nomor sama ya speaking Indonesia English please Okay. Okay. Mr. Bagus, Mr. Yeah, you may want to write down the answers on a document or something. Because yeah. you, lose the, you will lose the annotation when you go back to the main session, right? Oh, yes. Mm -hmm. I hope uh, you you got the note. I think we are done. Is Mr. Bagus? Sorry. I think we are done, right? All right. You may okay. go to the main room if you have finished. I'll go back to the main room as well. Okay. Let us blah 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 the problem blah 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 oh there are two words <laughs> please do it for to let us to let us to hmm. let us sort out maybe sort out and resolve yeah Number Uh, uh, and we stop them. Yeah. This way, I'm going to mm -hmm. and sort out, sort out the problem. Resolve <laughs> easy to try it. Yes, yes. <laughs> yeah, we can try. <laughs> Excuse me, I'd like to make uh, about the key facilities. Uh, complain maybe. Yes. Number eight, complain. Complain. Yes, complain. Complain. We assure you that we will. Number ten, I think is resolve. Number eight. Um... Okay, everybody. Everybody is back in okay. this room. Uh, for your information, the others, Miss Yeni and Miss Lisa, didn't actually finish our um, but. They couldn't go to the breakout room. That's why they were in the main session and uh, the the practice together in the main session. So let me share my screen so we can do the practice. Okay. We have ten numbers and we have ten people. Uh, I would like the first team. Mr. Priyo and Miss Puput. First thing is yes, Miss Priyo. Oh. Number four. Number five. Uh, number so one. Say... <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Miss, Miss Swati, was that you? I was saying. Okay, hang on. Mr. Priyo, which number do you want to do? Number one. Okay, go on. Please read it. I appreciate. I appreciate your taking time to help solve the problem at the site. Thank you, Mr. Priya. Well, the answer is correct also. Yes. Ms. Pukul, okay. your turn. But if you buy an electronic product, make sure you read the product warranty. Make sure you read the product warranty. Thank you. Well done. Uh, let's go to breakout room two. It would be Miss, uh, I think it was Miss Mati and Mr. Wahyu.
<laughs> They're still discussing who's going to go first. <laughs> go on, I'm then. number three. Okay, go on. I'm then. number three. Uh, if the goods are defective, the customer can sometimes accelerate as the seller to refund them. To refund them. There you go. Thank you, Miss Wati. Number four, Mr. Wahyu. Uh, as there were uh, ants in the cellar, the hotels and the manager came to us to apologize. Hey, thank you very much. Well done. And then breakout room three, Miss Hidayah and Miss Isa. Okay, so maybe I'll be first. So, uh, number five, we cannot accept a delayed delivery. We hope it arrives today. Thank you, Miss. Uh, was it Miss Hidayah who said that? Yeah, I think it's. Missy. Yeah. Gone then. The next one, Miss Isa. Number six. Number six. To claim that the furniture is broke, broken on delivery, don't forget to complain the store in three works days. Do complain. We, do we have complain? Oh, but it's a different word, Miss Isa. What we have in our vocabulary is complain with. T, it means that it's the complain. not the verb. The verb itself is complain without T. So number six is not complain actually. Yeah. Did anyone, uh, anybody have this, uh, the different mm. answer? Is it notify? Notify, nice, nice. Yep, that's correct. Notify. We need to notify. notify. Number seven and eight, let's go to breakout room four, Mr. Agung and Mr. Bagus. Number seven. Mm -hmm. Go on then. We'd like to send a technician to your office. What time will it be convenient for you? Thank you, Mr. Uh, Agung. Nice one. Mr. Bagus? Please wait for a while. Let us start off the problem be solved. Pardon, Mr. Bagus? Let us? Start uh, out the problem be solved. Mm. The you need to choose one. It's between sort out or resolve. 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 Okay. Resolve. Please wait for a while and let us resolve the problem. Done. Or you can also answer it with please wait for a while and let us sort the problem out. Oh, oh. Both mean the same. Both mean the same. Number oh, nine, the last, number nine and ten, the last room would be Miss Lisa and Miss Yen. Okay, maybe I'm the number nine. Excuse me, I'd like to make a complaint about the gym facilities. Okay, there you go. Thank you. And the last one. Yes. Go on, Miss Yanni. We yes, we do that. We will. Sort out your problem with two things. Got it. You can answer again. This is the same like number eight. You can use sort out or you can use resolve. They are interchangeable. Now we have four words here that we can pronounce better. 
how do you say the first word better? Defective. Almost, Miss Hidea. Defective. Defective. Oh, there you go. Mr. Wah, you got it right. Mr. Wah, you one more time, please. Defective. Defective. There you go. Defective. If the goods are defective, there. Defective means it has a problem Broken. with mm -mm, the things. Broken, maybe, or there's a chip there, something. How about this one? Sep. Right. Sep. The double C Sep. here means that you need to put the K sound. Accept. 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 Got it. Oh, accept. There you go. Accept. Mm -hmm. Well done. Accept. Wait, not accept. Accept is a different word. Accept is no. X C E P T. Accept. It's A. Accept. This one is accept. 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 Mm -hmm. We cannot accept. accept. We cannot accept a delayed delivery. Okay. Miss Hidaya, uh, could you please say a sentence? We cannot accept. A we cannot uh, we cannot accept a delayed delivery. We hope it arrives today. Thank you, Miss Hidaya. Well done. And then this one? Furniture. Furniture. Got it. The first U is pronounced as F, F. Furniture, I guess. Mm. So it's not furniture. Furniture. Fur, furniture. 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 And then the last one. A sure. Oh, nice sure. Sure. There you go. Okay. Sure. Just remember sure. that there's a Y here. A sure, sure. So it's not a sure, but a sure. <laughs> Assure. We assure you that we will resolve your problem with this. Okay. Now we are going to try to say sentences very quickly. Okay. So I'm going to randomly pick you and you need to say the sentence quickly. So it's not if you buy an electronic product, make sure you read the product one. That's not what we're aiming for, okay? We're aiming for this speed. If you buy an electronic product, make sure you read the product warranty, okay? Mm -hmm. We are going to say that okay. the sentences in that speed. Let's start. Miss Lisa, number one, please. Okay, Miss. I, I appreciate your taking time to help solve the problem at the site. Well done. Mr. Wahyu, number two, please. If you buy an electronic product, make sure you read the product warranty. Thank you, Mr. Wahyu. Mr. Bogus, number three, please. Mr. Bogus, you are muted. If the are defect, the customer can sometimes ask the to refund them. To refund them. Thank you, Mr. Bogus. Mr. Agung, number five, please. We cannot accept a delayed delivery. We hope it arrives today. Thank you. Miss Yeni, number four, please. Miss Yeni, you are muted. Sorry to claim that the furniture is broken on delivery. Don't forget to complain the store in the in three working day mm, but miss yenny i'm asking for number oh, four. Not oh. number four gone number four number four as there were and in the shot the hotel fnb manager came to use to apologize okay. Apologize. Apologize. Okay, one Apologize. more time. Please listen to this one. 
As there were ants in the salad, the hotel's FNB manager came to us to apologize. One more time, Miss Yeni. As there were ants in the salad, the hotel FNB manager came to use to apology. To apologize. 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 There's a, an S here, so hotels FNB. Okay, Miss Wati, please, number seven. We'd like to send a technician to your office. What time will it be convenient to you for you? <laughs> One more time. <laughs> will it be convenient for you? Conven convenience to you. We'd like to We'd send like to send a technician to your office. What time will it be convenient to for you? Okay, convenient for you. Thank you. Miss Ethan, number six, please. Convenient. Miss Isa, you are muted. Uh, sorry to claim to claim that the furniture is broken on the delivery. Don't forget to notify the store in three working days. There you go. Thank you. Mr. Priya, number eight, please. Please spread for a while and let us resolve the problem. Thank you. Number nine, Ms. Hidayah. Uh, excuse me, I'd like to make a um, complaint about the gym facilities. Come on, Ms. Hidayah, you can do better. Let's go faster this time. Excuse me, I'd like to talk okay. about the gym facilities. Okay, excuse me, I'd like to make a complaint about the gym facilities. There you go, Ms. Koput, number 10. We assure that we assure you that we will resolve your problem within two days. There you go. We assure you that we will resolve your problem. We assure you that we will resolve your problem within two days. Thank you, Ms. Pupot. There. Okay. Now for the next practice, again, we're still going to use the same words because we are practicing the vocabulary. However, in this part later on, you will listen to the converse uh, that conversation, the monologue to check your answers. So let's try and guess the answers for number one until number 10. Anyone? Can you guess what number one is? Pizza. They rate, uh, sorry. Uh, Mr. Agung, can you please write resolve there? Right. Right. Using the annotation, please write resolve uh, after number one. How about number two? Can anybody guess? It's notified. Notify, please type notify, Miss Wati. Number three. Delay. Delayed. Okay, Mr. Wahyu, please type delayed for number three. Number four, then. <laughs> Anyone? Number four? What do you think is the answer? Complain. Complain. Okay, Miss Idaya, can you please type complain? Uh, I'm sorry, I cannot. I cannot type. Oh, okay. In... Can yeah. someone Miss Hidayah to type complain for number four? How about number five? Apologize, Pardon, Mr. Bagus? Apologize, number five. 
apologize. Can you please type apologize then? Number five. Number six. Pandi. Pardon, Miss Pup. Miss Pup. Pandi. Okay. Can you please type the answer for number six? Number seven. Day. Pardon. Sort out. Uh, I think that sort out. Is it true? Mm -hmm. You may type the answer there. Number eight. <laughs> Okay, we still haven't got number six, five, number seven, two. It's not five yet. How about number eight, nine, ten? What are the answers? Okay, there you go, Mr. Agung type. Number seven out. Number eight, six, nine, and ten. Hmm. Oh, we have two warranties. We will check later. It's okay. No problem. How about number eight? Refund. Pardon, Mr. Agu? Refund. Okay, please type the, the answer there. It means that we only have number 9 and 10 to go. What are number 9 and 10? <laughs> okay, this one is Mr. Priya also said refund is number 10. Now we have all the numbers typed out. We are going to listen to the audio and check our answers. Okay. Ooh, somebody changed number five warranty to apologize. Okay. Let's check. Conversation for employees. Can you hear the audio? Book three. Yes. yes. One. Customer complaints. Word Vault, Customer Problems. Complete the following customer complaint with the words and phrases from Practice 1. Then, listen to check your answers. QuickNet service is very disappointing. They rarely sort out the complaints of their customers. And I'm going to express my disappointment regarding its service. I am a QuickNet customer with the customer number 123443, domiciled in Bandung. Since January the 1st, I haven't been able to use QuickNet because it hasn't functioned at all. TV, telephone, and the internet. I attempted to notify QuickNet's customer service and its officer asked for my convenient time, which I set January the 2nd. Then I received an official notification from QuickNet via SMS that there would be a technician coming to fix the problem on that day. Unfortunately, the technician did not come and did not provide me with confirmation. I immediately called QuickNet CS to file a complaint and several times thereafter, more than six times official reports to QuickNet CS. The answers from each CS were always the same every time I called. They apologized and promised to send a technician. They promised a free and prompt internet service warranty, but until today, April the 30th, 
there has been no clarity and follow-up to resolve the problem. As a customer, I feel disappointed with the delayed solution because I am still charged a subscription fee. Yet, I would still appreciate if QuickNet had a goodwill to deal with the problem. And I wonder whether it is possible that QuickNet will refund the bill for the service I did not use. There you go. We have some answers that we need to change. Which one is it? Because this is according to the audio, it means that it needs to be the exact same answer as the audio. Is that one you? Number three. Number three. What's the correct answer then? Convenience. Convenient. There you go. Thank you. Number three is convenient. Before number yeah. three, we have another one, one that we need to change. Number one. Number one. What is the sort answer? Out. Sort out. Sort out. There you sort go. Sort out. Mm -hmm. Number eight. And which one again? Number eight, the current is delayed. Delayed, thank you. There you go. Hey, I'm so sorry. And then what else? Number seven. Number seven. Number seven, the answer is? Resolve. Mm, there you go. Sort, uh, sort out is number seven. There's one more number that it's actually correct, but still incorrect. Did you get the correct, but still incorrect one? Number five. I think number there's a two, there are a two answer. Between mm -hmm. apologies and warranty. And the correct one is apologize. Almost. That's the correct, but still incorrect one, Mr. Priyo. It's not apologize. Almost. If you take a look at the next word here, it says promised in verb two. It means that apologize also needs to be inferred. So it's not apologize, but apologized with the ED, apologized. Okay, the answer is apologized with ED, verb two of the form. There you go. Now, this one, it will be quite long. I'm going to split this into three people. Can I have three people to volunteer to read this? Anybody? A volunteer? Jing, 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 jing. Nobody wants to volunteer. Okay, there you go, Miss Hidayah. One. And then? Anyone else? Volunteers? Volunteers? Da -da 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 -da. Nobody. <laughs> oh, Mr. Agung. Thank you, Mr. Agung. Well done. Okay, the last one. Um, um, should I choose or? Mini, 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 mo, catch tiger by the toe. Okay, there you go, Miss Isa. Miss Isa will read the last part. Okay, Miss Idaya, part one, a bit long, but I know you can do it. Uh, okay, so um, quick net surface is very disappointing. They rarely. Uh, resolve the complaints of their customers and I am going to express my disappointment regarding its service. A quick next customer with the customer number 123443 domiciled in Bandung since 1st January. I haven't been able to use QuickNet because it hasn't functioned at all. TV, telephone, and internet. And the internet. I attempt to notify QuickNet's customer service and its officer asked for my convenience time 
which I set on 2nd January, then I received an official notification from QuickNet via SMS that there will be a technician coming to fix the problem on that day. Well done, Ms. Uh -huh. Mr. Agum? Okay. Uh, unfortunately, the technician did not come and did not provide me with confirmation. I immediately called, called QuickNet GS to file a complaint and several times thereafter, more than system official reports to QuickNet GS. The answer from its GS were always the same every time I called. They apologized and promised to send a technician. Thank you, Mr. Agung. The last one, Miss Isa. The promise uh, pre and from internet service warranty, but until today, 30th April, there has been no clarity and follow up to resolve the problem. As a customer, I feel disappointed with the delayed solution because I am still charged a subscription fee. Yet I would still appreciate if Wignet had a good will to deal with the problem. And I wonder whether is it is it is possible that Wignet will refund the bill for the service I did not use. Thank you, Miss Isa. There you go. Okay, from this complaint letter, we have several words that we need to highlight so we can pronounce it better. How about this one? How do we say this word? Attempt. Attempt. Ah, there you go. Okay. Please remember that when an English word ends with T-E-D, it means that you need to read the T-E-D clearly. So it's attempted, attempted. Okay. There's another T-E-D in this uh Complain letter. Can you find another word that ends with T E D? Disappoint. Ah, there you go. How do you say that word then? Disappoint. 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 Got it. So it's attempted and disappointed. Clear T E D. Okay, and then, oh, no, not again. We have less than one minute. Everyone, so sorry. Please click the link again. I hope the next session we will have the premium Zoom so I don't have to re-click to ask you to re-click the link, okay? Uh, I'll see you back in one minute. Uh, let's re-click the link. So sorry about this. 